You're watching EAC News. Thank you for joining us. There are signs Cambodia's economy is starting to bounce back as restrictions ease and more and more people get out and about. The Ministry of Economy and Finance's General Department of Taxation collected 10.6% less in taxes over the first eight months of the year when compared to the same period in 2020. But figures for August are promising, as EAC News reporter Yuri Matosko explains. The taxman collected $1.9 billion in taxes between January and August, 10.6% down on the same period last year. But that's come as no surprise to Cambodia Chamber of Commerce Vice President Ling Heng. He believes the drop can be attributed to two main factors, less businesses activities due to the lockdown and the tax breaks given by the government to support sectors hardest hit by the pandemic. But the president of the Federation of Associations for Small and Medium Enterprises of Cambodia, Da Tampo, believes that business is gradually getting back on track. In August, for example, $192.3 million were collected in taxes. That's up 12.71% on August 2020. Another positive sign is the approval of the free trade agreement between Cambodia and China. Tampo believes the CCFTA will expand Cambodia's international trade. It's expected to be signed next month. Yuri Matosko, EAC News.